Hello friends, welcome to Simple Makeatronics. Today's learn at home concept is step by step Arduino Blink LED procedure. To learn Arduino Blink LED, you require a software Arduino IDA and a hardware Arduino Uno board, of course a system also. The Arduino IDE is open source software and available at arduino.cc website. You should download and install it on your laptop or PC, depending on OS. Once installed Arduino IDE on your system, then click Arduino shortcut icon, available on your system desktop. Then, the Arduino IDE screen appears. Now, select File Menu, Examples, Basics, and click on Blink. Then, a new window appears. Maximize the window and scroll down. The actual Blink code is visible now. The setup function is used for initialization, and loop function is used for writing controlling code. The LED built-in is a predefined keyword for onboard LED, which is connected to pin number 13 for Arduino Uno board. The pin mode is a function for data direction as input or output, which is set as output for LED. Digital write is a function to set a pin as logic high for LED on or logic low for LED off. The delay function is used to set microcontroller idle for so many milliseconds. The delay usage here sets the LED 1000 milliseconds on time and off time. Now click Tools from menu, select board, then Arduino Genuino board from the list. Now click Tools menu again, select port, the port for Arduino board is not listed. Now get ready with hardware Arduino Uno board with cable. This is Arduino Uno board with DC power input and USB input. Berg strips are soldered to this Arduino Uno board for more easy connections. The cable has USB, Type A, and Type B connectors on either side. Type B connector suits Arduino Uno board. Longer cables are convenient while programming. Using USB Type A, male and female cable may be connected to shorter cable to get longer cable. The main components are Power LED, Blink LED, RX, TX, LEDs, Microcontroller, Power Socket, USB Socket, Reset Button and Pin Connections. Now, connect other end of cable to USB Socket on your laptop or PC. Now, the Power LED glows on the Arduino Uno board. Now, click the Tools menu, then, Port, which recognizes the Arduino Uno board automatically, just select it. Now, select Tools, then Programmer, AVRISPMK2. Again, select Tools, then Get Board Info, to check the connection. Now, click Sketch from menu, then click Verify Compile, otherwise, click Tick Mark, to check compilation errors. Then, click Sketch from menu, and click Upload, otherwise, click Arrow Mark, to upload code to Arduino Uno. The RX, TX, LEDs blink while uploading the code, then, onboard LED starts blinking. Now, change the LEDs, on time delay is 100, and off time delay is 300. Now, recompile, and re-upload, the code, also called as Arduino Sketch, to Arduino Uno board. You may observe the delay of blinking LED after uploading the sketch. Now, change the values as 500 and 300 milliseconds. Compile and upload again. Now, again observe the difference. Disconnect USB connector from the system. Take one LED, the longer lead is anode and shorter lead is cathode. Bend the anode lead and connect 1 kilo ohm resistor in series. Soldering is advantageous. Connect cathode lead to any ground pin of Arduino Uno board. Anode through the resistor may be connected to any digital pin of Arduino Uno board. Now testing with pin number 7. Connect USB connector again. Now, replace LED built-in keyword with 7, since the anode of LED is connected to 7. Again, recompile and re-upload the sketch. The red LED starts blinking, instead of onboard LED. Now, shift anode of red LED, to pin 8. While coding, define using a keyword, like my LED 8, which makes easy to identify and modify the sketch, whenever required. Replace 7 with my LED keyword, since red LED is connected to pin 8. Again compile and upload the sketch. 
The red LED blinks on pin 8 now. The cathode of red LED may be connected to any ground pin of Arduino Uno board. Press like button if you like this video and subscribe for more projects. Thanks for watching the video. More explanation and more videos are available at Simple Makertronics website. Links for other projects are available at description below. Bye friends, see you in the next project.